Can you Archibald just text? Can you okay, yes, so my name is David Hebden. I'm the East Yorkshire Community Fundraiser for Yorkshire Air Ambulance. So I'm here today to, uh, to this motorbike rally uh, where they're raising some valuable funds for us. Um, it's great the support that we get from all these motorbike groups. The motorcyclists do tend to be heavy users of the air ambulance. Uh, we did 1,300 jobs last year. Probably a third of those were road accidents uh, and I wouldn't be surprised to earn half of that number would be motorcyclists too. Uh, it's wonderful the support they give us. Uh, it costs us an arm and a leg to run. I'll just pick up the yes. <laughs> just blew away there. That's Lance, Lance the Air Ambulance. Um, sick. Yeah, last year to run these two helicopters cost £4.4 million pounds, uh, and generally it's all paid for by the people of Yorkshire, the generosity of the people of Yorkshire that helps us to raise money at the rate of £12,000 a day we need to raise to keep those two flying. Um, a lot has changed in the way we operate nowadays. Uh, we frequently fly out with highly skilled paramedics and treat people who are seriously ill or critically injured at scene. Uh, and just over half the cases they then go by road to their local hospital where the more seriously injured patients are transferred by air to a major trauma centre. Yes, yes. There are four major trauma centres that cover Yorkshire. Um, James Wood Hospital in Middlesbrough, Mulroyle Infirmary, the LGI in Leeds and Sheffield Northern General. Last year we flew 600 patients, 90% of those went to major trauma centres. The system of major trauma centres has led to a 30% increase in survival rates for major trauma. That amounts to, across England and Wales, 600 people a year. And three times that number now makes significant recoveries that would have otherwise been left with permanent disabilities. Wow. It's a great system. Yorkshire Air Ambulance is only a link in the chain to get the patients there. The fact that we have these regional trauma centres saves lives, but it does mean moving very sick people a long way in a hurry. Say so we're a link in the chain, but we're the only link that is charitable.